Now we are going to talk about. I will give you example. Sorry about the uh, intermolecular dehydration. We have here two, as we have said, two carboxylic acids give anhydride. Let's illustrate this reaction. The first carboxylic acid is ethanoic acid, okay, and the second one, tamian ethanoic acid. As we have said, OH group here is with the H group gives H2O, and the molecule here is combined combined to this molecule here to give this anhydride. As we know, these two ethanoic acids are similar, same carboxylic acid. Then the formed anhydride. Is a simple anhydride because as you can see here this is the middle O on the right side we have two carbon on the left side two carbon and we call it one two two ethanoic anhydride no need to repeat uh, to call it ethanoic ethanoic anhydride you call it once because it's a simple anhydride ethanoic anhydride and the second example about the mixed anhydride here we have a carboxylic acid and another carboxylic acid but of it's not similar carboxylic acid. This is what one, two ethanoic acid, and this is one, two, three propanoic acid. As you know, intermolecular dehydration includes the elimination of OH here and the H here to form water. The rest of the compounds here and here are combined to give an, a mixed anhydride simply because we have two different carboxylic acids. They will give what a mixed anhydride. This is the middle O on the right side one, two, three from this carboxylic acid on the left side one two from this carboxylic acid naming it's simple one two three propanoic one two ethanoic uh, e is before uh, if it's for p then it is called ethanoic propanoic and hydride this is the intermolecular dehydration such reaction is reversible and yani, the uh, reaction uh, esterification uh, sorry uh, intermolecular dehydration is a reversible reaction Unless we use P2O5, which is phosphorus pent pentoxide, if we use P2O5, uh, the reaction would no more be reversible. That's, sim that's simple, because according to Chatelier principle, P2O5, which is a strong dehydrating agent, it uh, absorbs water. The water here on the right side decreases. According to Chatelier principle, the reaction is shifted in the forward direction to compensate this loss of water by Chatelier principle, meaning that the reaction is always in the forward direction due to the action of P2O5, and thus the reaction would be complete and non-reversible. Okay? Uh, the second reaction here is the hydrolysis of acid hydride. It's simply the reverse of intermolecular dehydration. Uh, in the previous reaction, uh, as we have mentioned, two carboxylic acids give anhydride plus water. Now here, the hydrolysis of anhydride give Two carboxylic acids. Example, this is a similar anhydride or simple anhydride because this is the middle O, ethanoic, ethanoic anhydride, H2O. Simply, you break the bond here, you give OH to the first carboxylic acid and H to the second carboxylic acid, and the result is two ethanoic acid from this ethanoic anhydride. The second one is what? It is a mixed anhydride because here we have one carbon and two carbon. Similarly, it is a reaction which involves a breakage of the bond here and this H2O gives OH to the first compound becoming CH3COH and H to the second compound becoming HCOH which is methanoic acid and ethanoic acid. Simply similar anhydride or simple anhydride gives two same acids, carboxylic acids, while mixed anhydride give different carboxylic acids.